welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another day on Alpha Polaris. We are stationed in the Arctic and we are trying to study polar bears but there's a lot of shady stuff going on and I don't know who to trust. My one kind of friend in the game, if you want to call him a friend, I had to sedate and then my date is all curled up in the hallway freaking out. I'm stressed. <laughs> but we are gonna dive right in and see what day three has to show us and teach us about this mystery. Too quiet. I don't like what that implies. Nova, are you in there? Oh. Let's see about Al. Where is everybody? Al. Okay, I'm gonna go to the lab. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, hey, Tal. You all right? Sorry for sedating no. you. Any pain in your arm? Don't worry about it. I would have shot that prick. He took my gun. He took my gun for fuck's sake. The monster. Try to encourage him in conversation. The monster. What do you think it is? It's the dragon. Like in the Book of Revelation. Like the one in the final battle of Armageddon. Oh, oh, in my dreams, oh, no. it's always hungry. And the dragon, it doesn't eat like we do. The more it eats, the hungrier it gets. And then it'll eat the whole world. Let's try to encourage him after that. Fight the fear, Tully. Things aren't so bad. <laughs> yes, they are. But it's okay. Because when I die... When I die, I get to sit with the lamb in the garden. Paps used to say that. Then the fucker died. And that's where we're going to end the conversation. This is the weirdest day. Nobody's here. What am I doing? Okay, so are they in the kitchen? Huh. Hello? <gasps> They're all in here. Hi everyone. Morning. What's going on in here? You tell us. Uh oh. You nearly pushed Tully over the edge last night. Uh oh. I didn't have a choice. Yes, you did, and you chose to pander to his delusions. <sighs> Nova's nightmare. Nova, tell us what you saw last night. I'm not sure what you're talking about. Girl! You told me there was a spirit worshipped by hunting tribes. You said you had another article. No. I need that article. You're not getting it. Uh-oh. Okay, so now it's just the storm. Al, tell us what you told me about the storm. Okay. You know, Rune, what I said about the storm and the spirits? I was speaking metaphorically, of course. Trying to rationalize Tully's mood swings won't do him any good. Dude, you are so wishy-washy. That is not what you said yesterday. Exactly. The thing is, this is not my first assignment in the Arctic. I've seen all kinds of bold fellows coming and going. Some of them much earlier than they originally intended. Rugged men, too. Look, speaking from experience, I see a dose of isolation paranoia here. A small dose, but one that could easily spread over all of us. Now, for the sake of Tully's health, let's keep our heads level. This has gone far enough. It seems that they won't agree with your story, Nitsen. That's because they're afraid. You know what I really think? I don't care what you really think. I think you are just the type of guy who likes to pretend he knows more than others. But in reality, you are way out of 
If it was possible, I'd fly you back to your socialist Sweden, or wherever you came from. I know how you can get me out of your sight. Send me to the crevasse. I'll take the additional samples you need. You? On the other hand, I can't spare my real people to get them. You're a dick. Rune. Now wait a minute, Alistair. I don't think that's a good idea. I can go. I don't have anything important to do right now. You're needed here to prepare the samples. While I do the testing with Nova. Very well. Just don't try to climb down there, and avoid going near the edge. Oh, I'm gonna go near the edge. I know how to scale ice. Crevasses are different. They're dangerous, even for seasoned climbers. The safest way to collect the samples is to lower a probe down there with a car winch. Once down, it'll automatically take the sample. You'll need all the weather gear you have. The temperature is gonna drop very low by night. Okay. And take your tranquilizer rifle. Okay. Screw you guys. Okay, I think I'm gonna need these. Yeah, and I don't know. Vacuum flask. No, <laughs> I thought I was clicking on this little water bottle thing here. Um. It's about this. A fusion jazz band, jazz band my brother always... My brother plays accordion in. They suck, but in a cool way. Okay, cool. <laughs> Wall probe and rope. Okay, I know where... Thank you for listing that out. Oh my god. See, I went and got those little, like, ice pick shoes without even, like, a request. I just thought about it. Okay, rope. That must be the oil probe. Oil probe. What else? And this thing. Okay. Scrap this, she's probably in the lab. I'm going to harass her until she gives me what I need. That's horrible. I don't recommend you doing that ever. Okay, Nova. Can we talk? Yeah, I was about to say it. I'm not really in the mood to talk right now. Too bad. Or you just don't want to. I'd like to be alone now, Rune. Well, how do I get it from her? Do I go steal it from her room? Hmm. We have to go to Tully. That's funny. We have to go to Tully to learn how to break into this girl's room. I don't know how to break into things. I'm a good boy. I'm a good Swede. Discussion in the kitchen. Yeah, I need to fill him in. Like, he's struggling. I've just been accosted by Alistair. Accosted? Al and Nova didn't say a thing to defend me. Mm. They're decent people. Al and Nova, I mean. Not that jerk off. But I think they're even more afraid than me now. Mm. And I'm terrified to the bone. Still, it doesn't matter anymore. We got shafted. That thing will come for us when the storm peaks. Uh-oh. You don't think there's anything we can do? Zippo. What I don't understand is why Al sided with Alistair. He's all chummy with Bob, so I guess that's why he's going easy on Alistair. But he's a good man, the Wiz. Nova's been having dreams, too. I spoke to her last night. I know it shows on her face, and you too. Am I right? Yeah, you're right. Maybe she's not that icy after all. But it's a real shame. You two would have been real happy. She has an article about the thing out there, but she won't give it to me. Huh. Just get it yourself. That's what I was trying to do. I'd have to break into a room. Do you fear more than the dragon thing haunting us? Do you have a master key? I have some blank keys. Old and shitty warded locks here. Maybe you can make your own master copy. Oh. That's what this is for. Press drill. Okay. You 
kidding me? Laboratory. I guess this one. Oh no. Um, what do I need to do? I don't want to mess this up. Um, all the pieces except for the fifth one. Because, like, it does make sense that, like, which one do they all share? Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay. We did it. Nose itches. Ooh, pretty. Laundry basket trunk. Oh no. Okay, how about we look at her stuff some more? Because I don't know. She has gone through the trouble of bringing a mirror here. Books. Generic romance novels and a few works of Ambroto Eco. Look at her nicely made bed. Nova has the coziest room here. No surprise there. She knits. Books. Biology and natural history. I'm gonna look at this bulletin board a little bit closer. Polar bears get bored too. This is so cute. Happy birthday. Tell me no more porn, please. Okay. I knew I had to look on here. I knew it. Hey girl, we remembered it's your birthday tomorrow. Hopefully the Greenland Post Service jets this Gets this, gets this, gets this delivered before you return. We all miss you and wish you were here. Aww. Um, okay, so it's 2 8 11. So 2 9 11. Okay, interesting. You're gonna make a comment on the bra. Those are nice. Uh-huh. Suitcase. It's right here. True gem. <laughs> I got an achievement for looking at the bra. <laughs> Milady, you have very nice bras. Anyway, um, Watika myth, this must be it. Okay. Articles. Okay. The Watikio Ashton myth. There exists a cultural a culture bound condition among Native Americans and the Esquimox, in which a people is driven to a psychotic state. In many of these cases, the individual becomes convinced he or she has been possessed by the Wittiko, Wittiko, the personification of the horrors extreme winter and the horrors of the extreme, the personic, I promise I can read. The individual becomes convinced he or she has been possessed by Watiko, the personification of the horror's extreme winter, of the horror's extreme winter, and they, of the extreme winter, of, 
of extreme weight. Yeah, there's misspelling there. I was I was actually having trouble reading because it wasn't written right. Okay, I got it. Hey, and they engage in cannibalism. There have been numerous documented cases as late as the beginning of the 20th century. The cause of this condition is widely disputed, but it has been suggested that it is triggered during the early stages of a developing mental disease, a burning sensation similar to the pain caused by frostbite and delusional thoughts of the presence of an extreme evil are described. Some scholars categorize them with night terrors tingling and evil presence occur in the Western cultures. The Greenland Esquimaux believe the Watiko is a primitive chthonic god in a world that preceded the coming of their pantheon. It is said to be a skeletal, it's said to be skeletal and deformed and be missing extremities. In some legend, it in some legends it has a frozen heart and glowing red eyes. And in general belief, Watiko has a, sim a singular hatred towards humanity that stems from the actions of humans. It is said to be a bitterly lonely creature trapped in the Borea Boreas Boreas, a region of of remote icy fells behind the northern lights, unable to descend upon the earth without possessing living beings. The Esquimaux believe their ancestors can be seen dancing in the sky. This might mean that malevolent spirits can also be seen. In primitive times, the tribes of Greenland relied upon their shaman for appeasing evil spirits, similar to the Wittico. For an Esquimaux, nothing between the earth and the sky is bad. But there are spirits that should be feared because of their hunger for hatred. From time to time, the Western psychoanalysts have been interested in the Wataco. I'm saying that differently every time. Psychosis. Some scholars see it as a testimony of an imperial, impersonal. I am so sorry. <laughs> an impersonal potency buried deep inside us that is instinctively hostile to human life. That was rough. I got the article. We can leave now. I have everything. Perfect. We have completed our breaking and entering. in the snow. Very nice touch. Raw oil, oil glistening down there. Al's flag. This is the place. Okay. Um, that won't work. Why? I want to work. Lynch. Design self recovery. Okay. Um. Oh. I did it right. <gasps> He's getting really close. I don't like it. Okay. What am I doing now? Now is that the what does that mean? Okay, I'm not doing something right. Okay, let me look at it then. Up, down, release. This I can handle. It's not time for that yet. I would like to tie you to something because I don't like how this is going. There you go. Oh my word, really? Oh my god. Oh my god, what are you doing? Oh 
Oh no! Oh, oh no! Oh. 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 <gasps> yeah, I'm going back to. Um, it's too dark to go in there. A cup. Ceramic cup. Flammable substance to ignite. Well, there's plenty. Use the key to scrap some off. I don't know. Wall footprints. Owl's footprints. Okay, so I need some oil from it. Okay. That makes sense. Do I need to do it again before I leave? Um, firmly secured. There you go. Oil. I am intelligent. Island tribe. Same symbols. I'll check the cave first. I don't think this is a good idea. Nearby are lonesome. Oh no. Is that an idol for t for Ashton? I have to find out what the mural says. Oh my god. Human and animal bones. Some of them have been carved and marked like the ones Al brought to the station. What made the walls curve in like that? Ew! I see seat. It has weird proportions. Oh god. Ow. Oh. Looks like a mutilated corpse. What does it mean? Death. No, I don't think so. Okay. Um no, I don't I don't know. I I need my thing. Okay. My bag. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Let's look at articles. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, I'm on the article page. Wow, I'm intelligent. That's mountain. This is sea. So, mountain, all the, or like, grounds. Okay, I see what they're trying to do, but I'm not going to be able to get this. Um, oh! Well, now I feel dumb. Okay, it's a shaman. Can't spell. That's from the article that we just read. Okay, so that makes sense. Oh! Reminds you of a diamond throne. Oh my word, I'm so sorry guys. Oh, 
What does it look like? Throne dedicated to the creature. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It reminds me of the Aurora Borealis. So it's Boreas. And this is the actual person. So Ashton, shaman, oh, up here. Oh, <gasps> stop. It's a Wendigo. Didn't I literally say in an earlier episode, I'm like, this reminds me of Until Dawn. It reminds me of like the Wendigos from Until Dawn. Like everybody's kind of like seen something but you don't know what it is and it's this creepy monster. Oh, it's backwards, right? Shaman throne, Boreas, Wendigo. I tried to summon Ashton down from the sky. Okay. No? Leave. Flee! Leave? Oh no. God. Hello? Oh my God. I'm so sorry. You took them, Rune. The Lord of the Winter took your hands. What? No. Oh. <laughs> What's going on, yo? Where is everybody? Um. <laughs> Fucking excuse me? Or anything you want to. Hell, we could just take the skis right now and go. I already said no. Oh. I told you they're all in the kitchen. Was there a weight on top of the radio? Hello? <laughs> Awkward. What's going on here? My hands hurt. <laughs> You're awake. How do you feel? Cold beaten up what happened you crashed the six by six and almost froze to death mm. but you're safe now while Nova was saving your ass last night cream went berserk and started to break things oh. I had to shoot him up with morphine to get him to calm down but I didn't tie him up now he's missing along with shaman somehow this is all you're doing how do you get that what really happened here do you want to tell me what really happened here? 
Tully and Al disappeared, and you heard nothing? That's, That's it. I need to kick your face in now! Well, <laughs> you spoiled Brat. Oh. If Rune hadn't been there, Tully would have shot you. People are dying here, and you just keep doing the same macho bullshit. Me and Rune are going to try to find a way out of this. You can take the skis and go wherever you want to. Hmm. Come on, Rune. Let's leave him be. Nova, wait. No. Fuck you. Stop. Please. No! You've got me all wrong. Oh, really? I want to help you. Mm. A hell of a way to do it. Right. I just... I haven't had any night terrors. I don't see this the way you do. You're lucky. Yeah, seriously. Literally, I just saw... I hope we're in the living room. Yeah, he broke the radio. He took a weight and smashed the radio. Go. How are we gonna find them? She's not in here. Where'd you go, girl? A lab? Maybe. There she is. What's going on? I'm so sorry I turned my back on you earlier. When that creature came to me during the night, I thought I was going to die. Or worse. Ashton is something I heard about in ghost stories when I was a kid. Saying it aloud in the morning, I just wanted to push that out of my mind. Hmm. Can you forgive me? Yes, you came for me. I, I, I would have frozen to death, of course. You don't need to ask that. You saved my life last night. But I didn't stand by you earlier. What we do next matters the most. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we need to go through all of what we know about that thing. Wendigo or Whitico or whatever they call it. There's nothing human in it. I know. I saw it last night, in the crevasse. Why is it here? Good question. Because of what Al brought? Because it wants to eat? Why is it here? I feel like it... it because it wants to eat, right? I think it wants to feast on humans. That's the whole point. It might be, but I think we ran into it. It came after Al got back with the bones. Yeah. What about the storm? It was also the first night the Ion Storm came. It's a portal to cut us off to make us mad. Coincidence. I think it's a portal. I think it's like a veil or portal. The spirit seems to be trapped behind it and is somehow using it to invade our dreams. Maybe it's trying to get us to do something for it, because it can't interact physically here. Hmm. You're right. It's trying to get a hold on us. I think its call affected the polar bears first. They gathered near the crevasse the night Al came back. Whatever it's trying to do, sooner or later it will consume us. If it really came from the crevasse, what exactly did you see down there? Scary stuff. A ritual chamber? The lair of Wendigo. I think it dwelled in there and snatched people from nearby human settlements. Hence the disappearance of the Tunajuk. I disagree. I think it was a ritual site. The Wendigo didn't dwell in there. Uh, what do you think uh, Al did down there to unleash it? Al did something. Is it reversible? <gasps> Let's return the bones. I could try to return the bones and the hide back to where they came from. Without the car? What if it comes when you're out there? It's true, we have to destroy him. You're right. 
It's not a good idea. We destroy them. I think the spirit is bound to the bone somehow. I'll destroy them. And the hide as well. Can you do it right away? <laughs> yes. The only way is to disintegrate them. I'll go and get everything I need for that. We'll find out soon if it works. Okay. Well, first things first. I'm gonna grab this stuff. Good. Okay. Now I know where gasoline is to light it up, and I have a lighter, so we just need to do it outside, I guess. Do I still have anything on me? Do I still have my stuff? It's not going to work, oh. Knudsen. Bones won't burn at that temperature. You need a much hotter flame. Oh. You could, but you need magnesium to ignite that. Well, thank him. Thanks. Magnesium. Aluminum, rust, and magnesium. Oh, I think I know where to go for rust. Okay, leave. Because I clicked on something down here. Yeah, over here. Isn't it rusty? Zinc or magnesium? Okay. Yes. Perfect. Oh, he's just watching TV. That's so nice. Okay. He's just watching TV. Can I grab that? Maybe. I don't know. What has magnesium in it? I don't know. Is there anything I can grab? Rusty barrels. For rust. Okay, now we go throw that in there. Um, the grinding tool.
<laughs> Do I have it now? Bro. Nice. Okay. We've done it, boys. Partially. I wouldn't have even seen that if the guide hadn't been like, by the way, look down. remains of plastic left no traces of the higher bones all right time to go talk to our girl let her know that it's done the deed is done okay are you okay no but i'll manage how are you feeling how are you feeling tired I just hope Al and Tully are okay. Do you know who did this? No, but I'm guessing Tully. I'm guessing it wasn't Tully. I got rid of the bones. Permanently. We'll find out soon enough if that helps. I'll be around if you need me. <laughs> Neither of you concerned. I'm gonna tell what happened. Oh, can we go in Al's room with the master key? Let's see if we can go in Al's room with that master key. I have a funny feeling. It's locked. Boom. That's a plastic model of a Boeing CH-47 Chinook painting. Doesn't seem to be Al's forte. I guess that's Al's light reading section. I didn't know he's into Russian classics. Arctic weather outside, negative four degrees Fahrenheit and Celsius, that's negative 20. Ooh. Some reference books and binders full of what look like measurement data. I think that's his deceased wife. The other photos, photo looks like the original Polaris station. Okay, I know what you want me to click on, but I'm just looking around. Oh, there's a telescope. Oh. I unleashed it, and I am to blame. Maybe I'll draw it out with me. Don't try to follow, Al. Oh no. Oh no. Why Tully left? I need to tell the others about Al's note. I wonder. I don't need to sneak in there. Well, why not? I want to talk to you about something. Turn off the TV. What? Rude. Um. Burn the bones. Good. What now? We'll wait and see. Let's just take it easy, okay? Let's do that. Okay. Let's talk about... I want to save Al's note for last. Did you have any nightmares last night? Okay. No. I don't remember having any dreams at all. I'm not sensitive to any of that. I found a note that Al left. I don't think he's alive anymore. So he was just as messed up as Tully. Me and Dad knew him well. 
I thought he was tougher than that. Okay, fuck you. Knudsen, before you go, what do you think that thing is? I don't know. Does it want to kill us or what? Yeah. Maybe. Or we could just be in its way. If you have any suggestions, feel free to contribute. I will, Knudsen. Stop climbing, Knudsen. It's so formal and kind of looks like mean. It's kind of mean. Are you okay? No, but I'll manage. I found a note that Al left. Apparently, he wandered out to the glacier last mm -hmm. night. Al saw that thing too, didn't he? I didn't yeah. trust Al. He kept everything inside. It's so like him. Can we follow him? Nova, Al's dead, and it's gonna be dark soon. I don't know. If we wander out there in the darkness... You're right. I'll be around if you need me. Okay, I'm gonna go outside. And look around and see if there's any hints for... Tully leaving. Oh my god! Oh my god. Poor bastard. I talked to him yesterday. It almost seemed like he had given up. Green never really adapted to life here. You were here the entire night. Didn't you hear a gunshot? I didn't hear anything. Nova drove the snowmobile right past his body last night. Why didn't she notice him? Keep away from her. She suffered enough. Don't pretend that you're the one protecting her. Regardless of what she may say, you're both still my responsibility. If it comes down to it, I'll use force to stop that thing. James finally caught up with him. Rest in peace. That's so sad. Are you okay? No. Is there anything I can do? Not really. How did he die? Mm. He shot himself. Did you see anything when you came back last night? Wasn't there anybody awake inside? No, there wasn't. I'll be around if you need me. What the hell? I need some sleep badly. You got it. I don't think I wouldn't sleep. Those nightmares, I would not be able to sleep. I'd be like, what? No. Rune, wait. Yes. When you said you'd be around if I needed to talk, could you come sit in my room for a while? Yeah. Anything you need. Would you like some beer? <laughs> Sorry. Do you feel any better? The others here know I grew up in poverty. I really had no one to lean on. I've always had to be strong. Mm. But now, for the first time in my life, I feel I can't. I'm exhausted, Rune. What if it returns and I'm too tired to fight it? It'll probably get the rest of us before you. I thought I was gonna die down there in that cave. I think you are anything but weak. You're the strongest of us. It's me you should be worried about. 
I've seen very bad things in my dreams, Nova. I did something to you. Don't believe that. That's what the creature wants you to think. So you're not afraid of what I might do? No. You should stay with me tonight. So I can keep an eye on you. Right. What about Alistair? There's nothing between us anymore. We briefly dated last year, but I ended it. Turns out his past traumas surpass even mine. Interesting. It's not easy to compete against your own father from an early mm. age. But not you, Rune. You are an incredibly honest person. Oh. I'm scared shitless, Nova. <laughs> That's pretty honest, dude. Yes, and still you had the integrity to face the truth. Mm -hmm. Stay with me. Oh, I'm gonna stay. I'm scared to have nightmares. <laughs> I don't want to be by myself. If you want me to. I don't want to be by myself. You know, if this is over tomorrow. Are you suggesting? Yes, when this is over. They're agreeing to have a date or what? <laughs> oh. 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 Yes. This is what I expected. I think I expected this, weirdly enough. Literally, there's a monster coming to try to kill you. Okay. I think I can hear it now. You gonna put your pants on? Nova? It's freezing in here. It didn't go away. Uh oh. It's here. Uh oh. The power's off. Uh oh. Everything will be fine, Nova. I'll be back soon. Uh oh. I'm scared. <laughs> uh oh, spaghetti holes. Where do I go? What do you want? It's freezing in here. The generator. No! I don't want to go outside. I knew there was a reason I could go to the generator. Gas. Okay. B2 is missing, but it doesn't seem to be the generator fuse. It's for the machinery inside. Okay. The power switch. Gear control. That's why I need that um, map. Okay, hold on. It's so loud. Okay. A1 laboratory. B1 storage. B2 B2 is the water pump. Um, C1 is the garage. Oh, it's the basement. Isn't it? Oh no! 
like his hands. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh no, meat. What am I looking for? mess it up. Hold on. Okay. It's Was a step I was missing. I had to literally look up a walkthrough because I'm like, I'm doing it exactly right. I have to fix the valve that's right here. Oh my god, I was so frustrated. I was like, I literally closed the game because I thought it bugged. At least I should be able to. Let's do it. Boom. I very strong with machines. Thank you! See, it was supposed to hit this little stall button and it kept going straight from here to here. So that's how I knew it was like not, not, something wasn't working. Oh. Alistair, the generator's running again. <gasps> Stop shooting, it's me! did something to her! What did you do? Oh no. Do what? Do what? I found what was left of her in the corridor. The blood. Nova? What happened to her? I hate them. The nightmares! I hate them! So are you lying Tell to me? Tell me what's happened to Nova! Listen to your lies anymore. It all ends here. Oh dear. You'll freeze to death, devil. Oh no. Oh no. Uh oh. <sighs> uh oh. Did I really do something to her? No. No. It's just something that creature wants me to think. Anyway, it doesn't matter anymore. The temperature is very low. I either let Alistair shoot me, or I freeze to death. Hmm. What you gonna do? Al? Stop! Al! Alistair! Nova is here! Alistair! Al is behind this! What? What? Well, it's a good thing I made this. Great. Okay, um... 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 This? Eee! I don't know. Should I go up to the roof? Eee! Okay, good. I got the Krampens, the like ice pick shoes, um, but they, I don't have them on me, but I found out where they are. Okay. Ugh, it's so gross. There they are. Okay. Hmm. 
He's put them on. Let's go. We climb the roof. <laughs> like I'm like, good thing I have a key I made, and it's like it's locked from the inside, dummy. I'm like, oh great. Okay. Oh. Frozen shut. Oh yo yeah, yo yeah, yo. Yeah. You are not MacGyver. I don't know what I'm doing with this. But the guy said to do it. <laughs> you guys are along for the ride with me. I'm mostly here for the story. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think it would work like that. I don't think antifreeze can just be put in a syringe. I don't think that would work very well. But if, if you think it'll help you, boo thing, you, you do you. My fingers are freezing. Hold on. I had to turn on my heater because this game is making me cold. Oh my god, what am I supposed to do? Disarm him somehow. I guess I'll throw the wrench. Oh. Try to fucking come in and I'll kill you! Um... Done. I murdered him. I must have left it. Wendigo Shaman. 
Indigo Shaman Ancestors. Well, this is Wendigo. What is this? You're not going to talk about the blood? What are you going to do? to decipher them. Um, interlocking V shapes. <gasps> oh no! I wouldn't have known how to spell this. This is like, I'm not able to do this kind of stuff. A human heart, because the Wendigo sign doesn't have the heart, but this does. He's at the crevasse. Crevasse heart. A human sacrifice, yeah. Um, We need to go to the crevasse and save Nova. Excuse me. Can I have that gun that you tried to kill me with? Yes, I can take the gun. I knew I couldn't trust Al. I was right. I'm supposed to suggest water pump. I don't get why. But it is a suggestion. The water melting well. That is only place I can think of, I remember Tully telling me there's a radiator and a pump down there. Oh, and now everything is moved. A bare hand. Oh my god. Oh my god. Al. What the fuck? I know what you're trying to do. I figured you'd understand sooner or later. That's why I had to come down here yesterday. In my dream, I saw behind the veil of the sky. I saw the truth. I All I, I see him. here is murder and wickedness. The Wendigo has put you under its spell. It stems from the wickedness of the modern world. You raped the Arctic and offered nothing in return, but the Tunajik did. That's why he spoke to me. He chose me. Me, an oil company prospector, but a sense of irony. That idol is a collection of cannibalized and murdered bodies. How can you say it will save the Arctic? 
My God. He'll take form through them. After the last rite, he'll cross the veil of the sky and walk on the earth once again. All that's missing is a heart. Oh no. No! I'm taking Nova with me right now. Think of what you're doing. This is your chance to save the polar bears. Okay. You're talking about murdering people, you sick fuck! Yeah. Get back! Uh oh. Very well. You'll have my heart. Oh. Uh. You want to follow that thing to hell? I'm just a vessel. Now. Ew. Oh, ow. Wait, is it really coming to life? You know, Thule's hundreds of miles away. Yeah, a lot can happen on the way there. What does that mean? What does that mean exactly? Think, are they gonna fake their deaths? That their deaths. They're gonna fake their death and just run away together, start a new life. Oh my God! What? What? But like, to be honest, it was a really interesting story and some of the puzzles were really obscure. I wish there was a little bit of a better method of deciphering the, um, the symbols because I really struggled with that. I had to use the guide for like every single one of them. Where you type in the suggest, have like a drop down of a couple of options, you know what I mean? I think that would have been like really helpful because I feel like I paid attention to everything. It was just really difficult to figure out exactly what they wanted, but it was really fun and I, I do recommend playing the game. I think it's interesting. If you enjoyed it, like the video and maybe subscribe to see more and Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video.